Okay, we have an American heavy duty engine lathe, model style D, uh, 24 by 174 centers, serial number 79340-73. Machine was new in 1973. Where are you gonna run her for you? Machine has a 16 inch six jaw chuck. Right now we're running, you can barely even hear it run. Um, 15 RPM, which is the low. It goes up to 1140 RPM. Machine has a lot of stuff with it. It has a taper turning attachment, a new wall model DP700 digital readout. Uh, it's got two 16 inch, uh, two, two six inch roller type stay rest. We just increased the speed. Okay, we're going up. How, 185? 195? 195. 295. Machine has thread dial in, thread dial. It also has a Laura's tool post. Right now we're feeding longitudinally. You can see on the digital readout as well. Hold on, let him sh let her show that. You see that? All right, that's the cross feed. Uh, we reverse on the carriage, the cross feed. You can see it on the digital readout as well. Hold on, let's show on the digital readout. Hold on, hold up. Yep, see there, okay. And reverse of the longitudinal carriage. So you saw the cross and the, and the, uh, and the feed work, the, work in both directions. We're gonna gauge the lead screw. Lead screw is turning, and now we're going to use the half nut, and we're threading. And you can see that also on the digital readout. Yeah. Okay. That's the tail stock over there. It's got a micrometer uh, feed dial, uh, and it is a number four Morse taper with 10 inches of travel. It also has a handle so you can move it along the rack and a lubrication, hey. All right, now the other thing it has is a taper turning attachment. I want you to show that in the video. Super. Okay, all right, hey, thank you for watching our video.